<clears throat> How you guys doing? Good? I hope so. My headlight on. Must mean I'm probably working on something. Not one in three o'clock in the morning things. Uh, I actually wasn't going to show you guys this. Um, I'm not like a big fan of box builds. Unless it's like a box that I'm building or getting ready to build or I want to know about, you know. So, I don't really like showing a lot of box building videos, but... Um, also, I'm, I'm not worth a shit at building boxes, really. But I figure I'll show you just for the hell of it. So I'm sitting around the other night, and I'm thinking, you know, uh, a while back you see my video called, like, Speaker, Speakers, More Speakers or some shit. I got, like, 12 of the Sony Neos in. And, um, um, I actually ended up, I, I ended up getting some more because I sold some. And I was just sitting the other night, you know, and I'd like to, I'd like to hear some of them. Like, you know, just throw them in my Hyundai and hook them up on my Kenwood amp and just, <clears throat> you know, hear how much extra sound they get. We need to build a box for them. So I decided to come out and build a box. And I have one of them done. Here's what's going down. Not that Bud Light. I'm not sponsoring Bud Light. My little box. These are the guys. So I don't have great lighting in here. It's these little cheap old Sony's Parts Express was selling. Uh, I'll probably show you without the cover later. It's these little guys, you know, they don't take much. They're rated like 20 watts. They're 8 ohms. I want to put two of them in two boxes. So I want, you know, two of them uh, you know, up in there. Not upside down, but, you know, top to bottom. I'm wondering if maybe I can do... Mm, nah, I couldn't do four. But, um, anyway... A lot of people, some people don't like showing flaws. I like showing my flaws to show you how shitty of a craftsman I am. Look at this shit, man. Ah, oh, fuck. Hold oh. on. I got shit overlapping. Check out these gaps. I gotta show you these crazy, crazy gaps. Look at that shit. Wow, yeah. Yeah, I'll fill that in with cocking. Yep, I said cock again. Anyway, um, I'm lacking a couple things in box building that I would need really bad and I would love to have, which is a Dremel. A Dremel can be awesome for many things, and when I have like a um, like a board too, a little bit too long, I can just kind of like saw it off easily instead of using my fucking jigsaw or uh, my uh, skill saw, which um, I don't know, man. I'm bad at like uh, given the given the length of the saw blade. Um, you know, figuring that into shit. I always have them just a little bit too long or a little bit too short or something, but Yep, gonna have some fun folks. See what four of these guys sounds like First by theirself and then maybe hooked up with all my other speakers just for fun Need to build another one. I got to cut the holes in this and uh, you know, probably paint it Just building out of scrap wood. I got scrap NDF all over the place Some there I painted and never used. I was going to use the seal off my trunk Eh, I still need to strip that car. I'm so switching cars one day. Yeah, I'm gonna do some work. Got a Civic build or a Civic update uploading here in a minute that um, kind of need some help on. All right, so I'm sitting here thinking, I'm thinking and thinking, right? Now what I do since I don't have a router is when I do subwoofer boxes, I'll put the subwoofer on there. I'll trace it, and then I'll actually kind of measure in the subwoofer to see how far um, I have to like go. So I so I'll hit the holes when I put it on there, and I'll go around the whole little circle going in like an inch, and then I'll like connect the dots. Problem with these, these are a weird shape, and when I trace them, I can't really go in and connect the dots because I need that to be round. So I'm fucking with this thing, you know that. It, cool guy gave me and I don't got no rod to go in it and I don't know how to use it and I'm thinking and I'm thinking and then I look up on my wall and what do I see I forgot I bought me some fucking hole saws and you know what that big mother right there I think it's gonna work perfect so uh yeah yeah check out this motherfucker Put it on there, move it around, 
I think it's like perfect. It's gonna be fucking sweet. It's on its own. Well, there's some good news and some bad news to it all. The good news is it makes me a perfect circle. The bad news is my drill is like on fire. It gets so hot. Look. There's how the teeth are supposed to look. I just burnt these teeth up. Of course, it is a flea market deal. My drill is actually smoking a little bit. It's not happy. But, guess we'll get out the jigsaw. Look at that snazziness. I wish I would have just used my, uh, my whole bit here to just make the tracks. And then, um, use my, uh, my, my jigsaw. Because my uh, Craftman drill that I've had, um, uh, 10 years now, almost 10 years, might have just about taken a shit. It doesn't sound too great, which really depresses me because I fucking love that drill. I've used it for so many things. Check this out, people. Like a glove. Boom. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's cut the other one. Bow. Check that shit out. Second one was like you just glided right through it because I pretty much had it cut until my drill about burned up. But there it is. Look at this. Boom. That's right. I'll show you my fuck ups. I uh, I got uh, half of it all, all uh, cocked up, you know. I got to seal the, the rest of it. But, um, yeah. And I need to get to work because I need another one just like this. So, I'm going to seal on it and then get to work on another one. But this might be all you see because, uh, I mean, you're going to see them. You're going to see them tested. Maybe in, even in my house. But definitely in my Honda, Hyundai. And uh, see what these bad boys can sound like. A couple things real quick before I end this video. One, I have my wood cut for the second one. And I got lucky on some stuff there. Um, if by some chance you're wondering why I don't have music. And... Um, uh, you, you think that I have it turned down because of YouTube you're wrong I actually work out here in my shed for hours and hours sometimes three four five so, ah, man I was out here forever when I was putting this wall this insulation up a lot of hours with no music I don't know why maybe it's just because I've been too lazy to bring a stereo out here um, but I don't listen to music I'm fucking deadly concentrated on what I'm doing so uh, kind of weird. Any of you guys ever, I don't know anybody else that works long, long time by themselves with no music. It's kind of, feel kind of weird about it. Also, of course, I had some people, uh, I had a lot of people comment, you know, especially since I built this shed shop or got it ready. You know, all the sidewalls, perfect grow house, right? That's all insulation. That's, 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 uh, I put that all in here last winter. I actually have it all uh, on YouTube. It's called The Shed Shop. Um, not only is that good insulation, it's also amazing sound deadener. I'm out here using uh, lots of power tools, um, skill saws. You know how loud skill saws are, jigsaws, you know, shit like that. And uh, I'm usually out here at 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in the morning. I'm using all these power tools. And uh, my place is just uh, a few feet away. And I don't bother anybody. So, yep, not a grow shop. I know everybody would love to have, um, a lot of people would love to have this building, especially where it's at in the middle of nowhere. But no drugs. Sorry.